Hi there, this is Just a Girl in Canvas, Alicia King, and it is Saturday, the middle of January, and I don't have a coat on. Um, we don't have coats on. We are in downtown Camas. And if you have not met these people, this is the Nick and Tammy crew, and you need to know them because I saw an article a while ago that said that this couple was getting married in downtown Camas, and the whole community was invited. And I was like, well, what? That's kind of weird. I don't know. Is this really happening? Time went on. I saw another article, and I'm like, this is happening in downtown Camas. This awesome couple is inviting the community to their wedding. I'm going to say it now and at the end, February 2nd at 2 o'clock at the Liberty behind us. I know you know where the Liberty is, but I want to talk to Nick a little bit. Let's, let's talk about this love story, Nick. I'm sure it's a great one. How did you meet Tammy? How did this come to be? Uh, so I went to school at the University of Portland. Um, I'm originally from California. Do you want to give a shout out to the pilots? Or? Whoop, whoop, go, okay, pilots. go pilots! Purple <laughs> pride. Um, so uh, I came up for like a last little hurrah. I had gotten into graduate school, and I was living in California at the time. And I was mm -hmm. like, oh, I'm just gonna come up, kind of say goodbye to my friends for the next two and a half years, because you know, graduate school is pretty important. So I yes. um, had to pay attention, uh, and just. Through literally randomness, we met at Kells through friends of friends Kells. at yeah Kells. Is a great I've been to Kells. It's it's a great one, and uh, we kind of just started talking, and we ended up at like she was supposed to go camping, and it, for everybody who knows Tammy, she's like the anti-camping person. So I does she glam camp? Yeah, yeah, that's it's not, the it's, way. It's, it's the not way. even it's not even called glamping with her. It's jamping. We have a jeep, and we just camp in the jeep. So, jamping. yep, it's jamping. Oh my gosh, have you, do you like have ownership of that word? That's amazing. I, I sh like yeah, we really should because okay. we have a nice little cushion that sits back there. Yeah, so if you haven't thought about it, jamping okay. is We the won't way get into details about that, yeah. but go ahead. No, um, so um, we just started talking. I went back to California, and after like two months of like probably talking daily, we were like, I think I might be dating somebody now. Nice. I don't know, yeah. And so. Nice. We started off this crazy adventure on a two and a half year long distance relationship. So long distance is hard. It was it was really difficult. We made it work. We did like probably every month and a half we would schedule a trip for her to come down to California or me to come up here mm -hmm. and we'd do little scavenger hunts in each other's houses to awesome. be like, Oh, you need to find a special surprise that awesome. I left. Yep. And great. yeah, it was that's how it started. And That's great. Two and a half years afterwards, I ended up moving up here because the debate was like, California or Pacific Northwest. I, is that a question? I know. Is that a question? It, it wasn't. <laughs> it was a question, and the pros and cons list went like this. Really good weather and really expensive on one side or really beautiful and I'm up other here. Reasons. Yeah, yeah, there's a whole We just can't list all of them right now. And we got to keep it on the down low, okay, yeah, Nick? It's true. It's true. Okay. I'm, I'm a California transplant. My bad. Okay, we still like you. We still like you. Yeah. Okay, so now this love, they're engaged. Tammy, talk to me a little bit. I'm going to even hand the microphone to you, girl. Talk to me about how this wedding and canvas came to be. So it all started um, when Nick and I got engaged and we started looking at wedding planning and all this stuff and everything just wasn't feeling right. Wasn't clicking. N everything wasn't clicking and this big formal thing and you know, yeah, it just wasn't clicking. So uh, last January we came to, I think, Clue First Friday. Yep. And uh, before that I had mentioned to Nick, at some way I want to include First Friday in our festivities. Okay. So whether they come for a Saturday wedding, I want everyone to be there Friday to come to First Friday, Fine. something. Yeah. Love it. And, um, but so then that clue First Friday in January, I happened to run into Carrie and Carrie asked how the wedding planning was going. And Carrie is with the Downtown Business Association. Yes. Good tie in there. Yep, mm -hmm. the DCA. And so um, I, she said, how's it going? And I said, well, nothing's really clicking we haven't found anything and she goes wouldn't it be funny to host a first friday wedding and i was like actually yeah yeah <laughs> that would be amazing because that would combine our two favorite things you know us getting married of course but also camas first friday which we knew we wanted to include somehow mm -hmm. um and so that's kind of how this process got started i love it yeah so 
Let's talk a little bit about this campus community, okay? So you love these First Fridays. Sounds like you're very, you know, the downtown here and you want to be a part of it. How has the community in your relationship in this wedding planning, like how have you felt the love from the community? Uh, this is definitely a Tammy okay. question. We'll hand it to Tammy. <laughs> so, so first off, I just want to say, I think the true story here is, is not about necessarily our wedding. It's about this community because everyone is so welcoming and so genuine and so loving and kind. We, we remember coming to our very first First Friday and it just felt different and we couldn't figure out why, but we felt so good here. Mm -hmm. And of course we had to keep on coming back because it of felt course. so good. Yes. Um, and so we are feeling 100%. I am humbled, honestly, by the love that we are feeling from everyone here. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Okay. And you want to give any input on that, Nick? I, yeah, you know, that was pretty well put. But um, I think the one big thing is, you know, right when we started coming down here, we just felt very embraced by everyone we met when we go into every single business I think that's the best part about first Fridays you mm -hmm. are you know going to all these places mm -hmm. and each one you know it's not that we you know bought a ton of stuff it was just sure. we made these connections with people sure. and they really were like hey we're so glad you came by we are just yeah not just that you had to buy our stuff we're yeah glad you're no here. just glad to see you yeah. and over time we just you know started to recognize all these friendly faces again and again and that again is and awesome. yeah we just love that um, I think that's fun because each one of these stores has their own personality, different owners, and that's what's so great is that it's what they have in the store, but you're chatting about your day or your life and making that connection, and that is community. That is what we're all here for, and so the more we're connecting like that, we're investing in each other, and you're starting on a whole new journey, you guys, and as we were talking before the interview, it's not easy um, if you're married out there in a relationship that's been going on more than the six month honeymoon phase it's a lot of work and so why not support a couple through community and i'm really excited for you this story is awesome and i'm inspired it's past my time been married everything but if i were doing the, that now i think that would be an awesome way to go is bring your community into supporting that marriage in your life what a great start and, oh. that's, and that's just what's really important to us, that we can share our life with the city of Camas, but hopefully people come to start sharing their life with us a little bit too. Awesome. So. Awesome. so I'm going to go over the time. Well, one, sorry, one more super quick thing. So um, are you using some vendors that are local for like cake and things like that? Do you know any right off, Nick? Literally, give a shout out? all the vendors are local. So Cake Happy is doing a wedding cake. Truly Scrumptious is doing a bunch of treats around town. Um, Hana is doing some food for us. Cool. Kop Choi, Mill City, La Mesa, La Mesa Natalia's uh, Wild Hair. Wild Mom Hair. Yeah. Yep. I mean, everyone. Um, almost everyone is Salud, a part of it. Caps and Taps, yeah. Spirit of Time, all of oh these places God. are. Yeah. Journey Church. Oh, Feast 360. Feast 360. Oh my God. Everybody is getting in on the action. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Well, in February 2nd at 2 o'clock, if you can, I would like you to join this couple um, for their wedding. Tammy is saying, join us, join come us. On, It'll be down here at the Liberty Theater, 2 o'clock, right? Two what, after the wedding, is there anything? There is. Yeah, we yeah. are doing, um, like, 3 to 5, we kind of have a little reception kind of okay. at a bunch of different places. But okay. the big shebang starts from 5 shebang. to 8.30. We're going to have a tent over on Cedar Street. N um, dancing? Yeah. Dancing, like, can people music. come and dance? Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. Everybody. And, and I'm most excited about we're having a wedding bingo where people have to take photos or videos and how it matches the bingo card to this get a bingo. Amazing. It's going to be really fun. This is amazing. I'm going to be here. So February 2nd at 2 o'clock, come support this wonderful couple. And I just have to say, awesome. This is community. You guys, I admire how even in your youth, I'm going to say youth, you are tuning in so much earlier than I did to what it's all about. And I really admire it. And I'm so excited for you guys. So it's going to be an awesome journey. I feel it. All right. And I'm going to give this special shout out. If you comment on this video about your marriage advice for Nick and Tammy, I'm going to pick a winner for a special prize because I think it'd be fun to hear what our community has to say. So think of something meaningful, maybe from your experience or overall, what you think can help this marriage be successful and grow and work. So 
Anyways, what a great day. Thank you so much for your time. I love it. Yeah, you guys are awesome. Check out their wedding February 2nd, 2 o'clock. This is Just a Girl in Camas, Alicia King. Thank you. That's it.